computer. Good evening, good evening, good evening, good evening. Uh, tonight, I want to quickly share something. Uh, I titled it, there's going to be a series I'm share. I'm, I'm, I'm going to start right away. It's called Life Lessons. Okay, this series is called Life Lessons. As you can see here on my screen, I titled them Life Lessons. Uh, today, I'm going to cover something on achieving results, on achieving results in the face of adversity or in the face of challenges. And I'm going to tell you the purpose for which every challenge you see when you start a vision why that happens. So, welcome once again. I know we're all ready for tonight. Um, we have about 106 people here. I actually, actually like, in short, one of my plans for Lagos was that we're going to have a time either in Lagos or in Dubai uh, where we're going to have a boot camp. And this boot camp is going to be open to just a hundred people okay and these hundred people uh will get they're, they're like my mentees and i like those kind of teaching in as much as i like crowd i also like a teaching a setting where i can actually pinpoint one two three four five six person and people who are serious and ready for execution people who are ready to execute uh, what we are teaching, okay? So tonight, let me let you know something. Last week, I shared a very important voice note. I was in my room, and 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 certain things came to me. There were two advert ideas that showed up in my spirit. Now, there are things I'm going to reveal tonight because, you know, there's nothing like PowerPoint presentation here. Wow, I'm just here receiving alerts upon alerts upon alerts. If it's Chigozi, we'll call it Sinzu Money. One, two, three. Okay, this is good. Okay. Alert is good. At least money is a reward for efforts that you've carried out, or the efforts, or the or the stuffs you've done. Um, so, so today, uh, I discovered that there was a, there was a particular ad advert that came to my spirit last week, and the first thing I did was I jumped on my feet and I screamed. I screamed, you know, like, damn, I got this thing. I got this thing, you know, and immediately I got the idea. The first thing I did was to call some of my friends or two, two, three persons. And I shared it with them that this is the next ad idea. You should ever have to do a voice note and drop in the group. And what was the next thing? The next day I had a meeting with my, some of my team members at Daba and I shared the idea to them. So when an idea comes to your spirit, what is the first thing you are supposed to do? Because I want to teach you how to go from idea phase to implementation, to achieving the results. When an idea comes to your spirit, when a vision comes to you, there are several things you've got to do to make them happen. Number one, write them down. The Bible says, write the vision, make it plain that whosoever sees it will run with it. Now, this is, uh, of course, I have several papers here. 
Now, these papers, okay, when I write down my goals here, yeah? I write down my thoughts here, yeah? I write down the next thing to be done. This is the latest course I'm launching on that, but you guys are going to see it tonight. This is the paperwork I did. This is, this is for Daba Women's Ladies' Night. See how I started doing my own design on paper. I wrote it down. And after writing, the next thing is talk to your vision partners. I'm going to come in here. I'm going to help you understand. Who are those vision partners? They may not necessarily be, vision partners can be your team members. Your team members who are working with you in a company now also your vision partners. Okay? Your team members who are working with you are also your vision partners. That's one. Number two, um, you can have people who you share those bodies with and they will tell you, oh, good, 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 good. I have that like that. I had one time like that, one of my, one of my partners back then. I, whenever an idea comes to my street, I call him on phone as even 2 a.m. I say, this is the thing that came to me and we're going to execute this. Some of them may not happen. Some of them may happen. For the ones that happen, let me tell you what happens when you start to pursue an idea. When you take off a vision, when you take off a company, when you take off an idea, when you take off, uh, uh, call it whatever, whatever you want to call it, when you want to launch the next big theme, launch a big project, launch this and launch that. And I'm going to use a story to share with you. When I relocated from Calabar down to Lagos to take, to take off digital abundance in, the early 20, in early 2018, of course, I was coming to Lagos 2017. I was born and brought up in Lagos. I did all my, even my, my secondary school. It was just university that took me down to the east. And uh, later on, I said, I want to explore. I don't want to come to Lagos back. So I don't come back to Lagos. So next, after school, I did my wife in Port Harcourt. I later located to Calabar. I stayed in Port Harcourt for a while. You know, I've been to different, different places in this country. You know, I've lived in different places. Even in the north, I've lived in the north. I've lived in the south, south. I've lived in the west. And yeah, I'm I today in the city of Lagos. And then on, I, I was in Lagos 2017. I stayed three months one time away from my mom, away from my family, and just pursuing my vision. And I saw it was time for me to really, really, really be in Lagos and do some work. And everything was in motion. I was like, as we start, we're going to hit big, big results in 2018. Of course, I had some fat seven figures in my account. I wasn't starting. So I got my office space. I was paying for stops. I wasn't feeling it. You know, big boy. And as 2018 continued, at the end of 2018, uh, the market began to behave somehow. Okay? From 2018, me do. Some shit started happening. You know, from June, July, entering 2019. But within that period, a lot of things happened. Now, when you start with any vision, let me tell you what happens. I don't know. This is not a, an eternal formula. This is not a formula for everybody. But in case you are among those who start a vision, and the next thing, you were sure of so many things happening, and boom, one challenge hit from the left. Another one hit from the right. The business, the economy is now going fine. Let me tell you what to do. Let me tell you what those challenges come to do. And let me tell you how to navigate in those seasons. If you're with me, let me see it in the comment section. Are you ready? Are you ready to hear this? Are you ready to hear this? Are you ready to hear this? The first thing those challenge come to do, you've written down a vision. You've written down a vision. 
You've written the vision down. You've written the name of the company. You've written everything. You've written how you're going to make sales in the next three months, in the next one year. You've written a business plan. You've written a pitch deck. You've written how you're going to build that up. And now you're going to get the next investor that will give you $100,000, $50,000. You've done, on your part, you're good. On your part, you've cleared, you, you are ready. Your energy is pumped. Your energy is high. You, you can see the vision happening. You, everything is set only for you to just fly. And at that moment, the engine isn't kicking well. The tire just bursts. The market isn't responding to you the way you're thinking. You, you, you started the course and, 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 and you ran adverts and you were not even making sales. And, 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 and you launched the product and instead of 100 sales, you're seeing five sales, two sales. And later on, at the time, your company is almost going as though, man, that there's no money in this thing or there's money in it. And all we are doing is to survive, survive, survive. Because at the face of challenges, you are not thriving, you're just surviving. And at that face of surviving, so many things can happen to you. It can be at that face, you can lose hold of the vision if you're not careful. And it has happened to a lot of people. They start well, they start with the vision, they start with the paper, they start writing. They, they, they are ready for this thing. Six months down the line, five months down the line, things aren't working the way it was. The clients aren't coming the way it was. It's supposed to be. And the next thing, they are considering so many things. They are, even ready, they are not even attending all kinds of seminars, all kinds of webinars. And all of a sudden, you're asking them, how far with that thing you ought to start with? And they're like saying, man, let's start first. Let's just survive first. Let's just survive first. Let's just survive first. Once a challenge gets you to remain at the survival phase, you are losing the battle. You're losing, you're losing momentum. You're, those challenges don't just, they don't come to kill you. Let me tell you the number one purpose those challenges come to do. They come to remove your eyes from the vision. Because you see, you can now start living a life of circle. You're just going in a circle, circle, circle. Your life is in a circle. You're not progressing, you're not going back. You're not progressing. You're not going back, but you're still just there, stuck in a point. Why? Because some things hit you, and you're trying to recover from it, and all you're saying is, let me just survive. Let me tell you something. The Bible says, write the vision, make it plain, whosoever sees it to run with it, for the vision is yet for an appointed time. The moment you write these things down, the moment those challenges come, if there's anything I'm going to beg you to do today, don't lose hold of the vision. Don't lose hold of that idea. And this is how you have to do it. Once in a while, take that paper, take that note, remind yourself why you started this journey. Remind yourself the areas of your strengths. Remind yourself the seasons where you were crushing it. Remind yourself. Remind yourself the seasons you had zero and you survived and you launched out. Remind yourself. Remind yourself the seasons where it looked that this isn't going to work out and you pulled through without anybody's support. Remind yourself. Remind yourself, hey, life is not a bed of roses. Uh, I've taught you, you know, I teach you how to achieve success. I pump you up on Dabba. But I come to tell you here the raw truth. You are going to start. One of the ways you got to win is anticipate challenges before they come. The reason people break down when they see and they start the journey 
and the tire has just burst and the engine is just having an issue or there's a carburetor issue or there is something that is not working, the reason why people back out from the journey is because they were thinking everything will go smooth. You must start with this. Anticipate crisis. Anticipate challenges. That's how to be ready. The Bible talks about be ready and keep yourself with the whole armor of God. God himself telling you in the Bible, equip yourself with the whole armor of God, the sword of the spirit, the shield of faith. He's telling you, equip yourself with all these things. Even God has seen the end from the beginning. The same God that told you, I have good plans for you. The same God that told you everything is good and perfect. He's the same one telling you, equip yourself with these things. Let me use the Bible here, the shield of faith. He's saying, don't lose God. Don't lose faith. Don't stop believing even when it looked like things were not working. I'm going to tell you that bad story. 2020, I don't know for people, but Corona period was one of the biggest profit period for us. Not just that. From December, while I was in Dubai, till today, there is no day we don't make sales. I mean, I don't even hold a webinar to tell people come. I don't even know people who join. Some, some people join this our pl company, our platform. They buy from us. They don't know me. Some people think in the, in, I'll go to some WhatsApp group. They'll be, they'll be chatting me as if I'm a student. I've seen exponential growth. 2019, it was a see challenges held me here and there. Yet, you will not see me come to my WhatsApp status to complain to anybody. I held on to the vision. There were times when I would do certain trades. I would lose money in a trade. And I was like, but I did everything right. Hey, I forgot the stop loss here. Yeah. Oh, no. Ah, I did everything right. And the next thing, I'm short of profit. And the next thing is, ah, how do I fix this thing? The, the investor I wrote to, that made us believe that in 2018, we're going to get over a hundred dollars, thousand dollars from them, and they failed us. Ah, guess what? That money we, are, we needed from an investor in 2018, in, 20, in 2020, I signed the same. I signed the same deal and got the same money to do better business. But if I gave up in 2018, I'm not sure you've been listening to my success story today. See, when, the, when you try and try this, go back to the drawing board. Life is a battle. You didn't come here to play. First off, if you want to watch an inspiring moment that, 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 that can inspire you, go and watch AC Milan Liverpool some years back. When Liverpool won the Champions League, I mean, my United fan, normally my United fan, we're not supposed to love Liverpool. But for that night, I love Liverpool for that night. 3 0 down, 2 5. 3 0 down, Shevchenko, Kaka, they finished. What is Liverpool? They finished Liverpool in the first half. You know who Kaka is? Kaka would drink. Dribble you, you be thinking of who your parents are. Shevchenko was a prolific goal scorer. Sidorf was there. Paul, Paul, Paolo Maldini. Nesta. Name these people. Dida. Boy. 3-0. They gave Liverpool. They were using 4-3-3. You know, some of you watch football. You don't even take certain lessons. What did Benitez do? He discovered that the midfield was where AC Milan was using to enter Liverpool. <laughs> oh, let me take my water. In Italy, in, 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 in Turkey. And, and that day, and the man just said, three, five, Three, three, five, two. Torres and one of this other guy, Rene or something, stay in front. Gerard, this guy and this guy, five of them. 
They locked Kaka. They locked Sidov. They locked them. The first goal came. The second goal came. Boy, let me tell you something about life. The moment you think you've gone down and you start pulling a comeback, maybe when you went down 600% down and you come back 200%, come back 400%, by the time you come back at 600%, your inspiration is mad. There's a reason we tell people don't give up. We're not telling you motivational speaking. We're telling you if you can just hold on one more and strike again. And Ali called it, try again. And we're saying, you go back. The business, you, you, you did your Facebook ad. You did certain things that didn't work out. You, you, you spoke to investors. They didn't give you money. Huh. Man, go back. For me, my company, what did I do? I went back. I said, bullshit! Going back. Some of my team members lost faith. But you are a leader. You don't lose faith. Just like when Moses was taking the children of Israelites from Egypt to the promised land. Some of them lost faith. No, you don't lose faith. You don't. Even if anything... Boy, even if a million naira is no longer in the pocket, just believe. It is not motivational speaking. As far as your eyes can see, if you can hold on one more and decide that I'm going to the drawing board, I'll make that phone call. 2019, there were times I needed to make sales. I'll, say, I'll tell my team members, guys, we've not made one sale today. Go to your WhatsApp contacts. Who did we tell about our programs and all that? Call them now. Tell them to go and buy online now. Tell them I said Chris and he said you should buy. Sometimes I would take the phone and say, yes, the other day you said you're going to buy. So what happened? They say, uh, I said, now go. I'm giving you 60% discount. Buy now just to make sure a deal close. Just to make sure I close a deal. I would tell them, go now, buy. I'm giving you 40% discount. What if I, oh, the, oh you said the, 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 the product is how much? $150, okay. Remove 50% off. If you pay this night, I'm giving you $100. Yes, deal. Take it. Take it now. So I want to pay two times. Pay the $50 now. Tomorrow you pay the main $50. And I, that's how we see a deal. Because you see, life does not give you what you deserve. Life gives to you what you demand. If you need the 10 million, start demanding it now. I'll be on phone. I'll say yes. I'll say yes. I'll go to old messages on WhatsApp. I'll say, okay, why have you not purchased? Okay, good, 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 good. Well, yeah, go now. Click the link. Click that link. Click that link. Click that link. Uh, next thing, I'm on WhatsApp status. Next thing, I'm making the next phone call. Ah, I said, no, no. A day cannot go. will not make sales. Because life gives to you what you demand. You keep pressing. You keep pressing. You keep pressing. 352, formation change. Three defenders. Lock Kaka and everybody from the midfield. Don't block, don't allow them to come. Don't allow them to come. Because it is when they break the midfield, they can score goal. If they don't break the midfield, they can't hit our defenders. Skettle, you and Dudek, stay on point. Boy, when you see life at your down face and you are coming back, I tell you, no. The reason why I can talk like this is because I have tasted what it means to see luck. I can tell you that I can't go back there. Uh, Liverpool won Champions League. When Gerard left again, they still won. They won again, even when Liverpool, when Real Madrid pulled them away. They came back again. And, and even when there was no Salah, Salah put it there and said, don't give up, guys. You're coming back. This is not motivational speaking. I know you are in an environment where you have all the limitations. You're not in Dubai. You're not, in, you're, not in, you're not in the best of country. But I'm telling you one more time that you don't need to now depend on government to make things happen. You only need to just believe and start making that move. Oh, they said the good. Call those people in China again. Why is my goods not in Nigeria? Make that phone call again. Make it again. Hey, clients, you guys say you're going to buy. What happened? Me? Dollars is the only thing you have. Launch that Instagram ads now. Do it, do it, do it. Do it. The reason, the reason, the reason, the reason you are not seeing that result is because you backed out too heavy. 
I didn't tell you that when you start an online business, you make one million overnight. I'm telling you that when you start, you've opened the door for opportunities. And let me tell you, by the time you break it, boy, your success, I don't think 500 of my village people cannot stop me again. In short, they are now coming to me for lessons. Because at this phase, I have conquered several things. And I'm on that path. I said, I said it will take the next 12 months, we'll do a million dollars and it will shock people. We'll first cross 100. But then we'll cross 100, it opens up. You know why? When you make your first 1 million, you now see the possibility of making 2 million. What about when, when you enter 10 million? You see probably you're doing 50 million. When you cross 20, 25, and you hold it in your hand and do it, you start seeing that 100 million is possible. By that time, you start thinking in numbers. You start saying, what does it take for me to get 100 million? You look at it and say, okay, okay, uh, 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 50,000 Naira stuff, okay, 20,000 divided, 100 million divided by 20,000. You remove this one, you remove this one. You remove this one and you say, ah, uh, ah, uh, Oh, 10,000 people. So if I have 1,000 users and it grows to 10,000 users at this rate, I can do 100 million. Oh, but you see, you need to conquer the time when five could only buy. You need to conquer the time when it was only 10 you could sell to. You need to conquer the seasons when it was only 20 you could sell to. Sell well to those 20. Nurture those 20. Sell products successfully to those 20. Market those 20. The next 100 will come. Are you faithful in that need to? Or are you just jumping, jumping everywhere? You're jumping everywhere. You're not, you're not, you're not, you're not stable. You're like this. You did the podcast today, you stopped. You, 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 you did everything, you stopped. Why? Why are you stopping? Why are you stopping? You're almost there. You're almost there. Hit the rock again. Let water come out. You're almost there. You're almost there. You're looking at Mr. B. Because Mr. B has bought a car and you did not buy a car. And you're saying, Mr. B, what was he doing? He's not even working harder than me. Shut up! Your lesson is different. Your battle is different. I came here tonight to remind you because you know these things, but you need to remind that. And you need someone to push you again to remind you that a AC Milan that won 3 0 in first half does not mean they'll finally win the match. The match has not ended. It's just 45 minutes. It's just the second half of the year. And you're already giving up. It's just the second half of the year. And you're thinking you can't put 10 million in sales. It's just the second half of the year. Boy, one day, I woke up one day. The kind of alert I saw, I went back to sleep. I said, I have peace of mind. I I went back. I went to sleep. I went to sleep. I said, see, what, what, what is this? I said, God, how could you be this good? That's how life can be. You struggle. I looked at the alerts. I was in the night, and I came to my team. I said, let's do a meeting. I said, this thing will pump. It will pump to this level. Oh, good, good. I went to sleep. Because you see, poverty is what makes people not to sleep well. As I'm, I sleep well. Poverty is what makes you wake up with hypertension. Start wondering, how you going to pay the next bill? How you going to pay the next bill? At the time, my younger brother had to tell me, okay, Chris, you know you need to buy this new car. So I went, I said, okay, take, take this social amount of money. Buy, buy, let's buy this thing. So I, I got a new Ford, a Jeep. I said, okay, bring it. I didn't even announce it. I said, take. So I was like, you need to, I, I, said, I, I said, I've forgotten. I said, I forgot, I don't, I said, I've forgot. I don't, I said, I've even forgotten. I said, I said, I've forgotten. Like, I've forgotten that I should even buy a new car. Like, I've forgotten. Not like the money was not there. I've forgotten. Like, do I, so, like, do I even need this thing? Because I don't even go out too much for meetings again. What I do more is fly. What I do more is, okay, just have it for the sake of letting it be packed there. You need to grow to that phase. You need to grow. But you see, in the process of getting to that phase, you need to get to the place where you aren't giving up because you did not make one sale. There was a time when I'll be coming down from Kanu. I'll see pay start, send off alerts. Last, early last year, I'll say, ah, oh boy, so we made sale. So we made sale. There was a, let me, do, let, 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 me let me shock you guys. Let me shock you guys. I, I, I know, I know, I know it, will, it, will, it will come like a shock to you. But as of 2018, there's a time when I see 100,000 100, as sales in one day. 
I'll be happy. Like, I'll, not like, not like, like today, man, we've never done 100K in sales, but, but we've crossed certain levels. But, okay, yeah, we've actually done, we've crossed, we've crossed, we've crossed, crossed 100K in sales today. But, you know what? There were times when you do that 100K, you are happy. Even now, I'm still happy. But that happiness even from now. Because now we can burn 100K. We can burn to, I, I look how much I was giving out lately. And so there's, there's a time when, by the time you remove 20,000 Naira from 100,000, your heart starts panting. Boom, 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 boom. One day, one day I was so feeling good with the money with me that I went on Twitter, I said, I want to give out money. I said, I'm not giving out this money because I want followers. I want to see how it feels like giving out money. Ah, I don't know why rich people even do those kind of giving they give. I don't know why rich people do those kind of things. Sometimes give money because you want to be healthy. <laughs> you are giving out money because you want to be healthy. You want to feel good. I learned that thing from one of my guy one day. He said, Chris, I'm angry. So now that I'm angry, I'm going to share 50,000 50, to 10 people. <laughs> he said, I'm angry. But I'm going to see. So he called his Facebook friend. Who are 10 people now? Maybe you need school fees for your child for something. Just drop account number. And I'm going to send 50,000. 50, he said, I'm doing this because I'm angry. And I think when I give out this money, I'll be happy. The devil is a liar. I will never be poor again. Never, 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 <laughs> never, never, never. 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 <laughs> Never. Never be poor. Never. Never. You're giving up too early. You're giving up too early because you're also rushing. You think life is rushed. I'm 30. I'm 30. And I'm proud at 30. Like, like, I look at myself. And the reason why some of you, some of you are feeling depressed is because you look at your results and you look at your age and you start saying, ah, but now person day 24, we don't do this one now. And you forget that there's 50 more years. There's 20 more years. There's six more months for 2020 to end. And, 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 and you are looking at your entire success based on what you are just achieving now. That's why you're foolish. That's why you're getting depressed. That's why you're joining people who are committing suicide. That's why you're committing, joining people who are looking at Instagram and they get depressed. It's because you're looking at your result based on only results you're getting today and not the seeds you're planting today. What are the seeds you're planting today? That's what I'll use in knowing what your five years is. Shut up! Go back and walk. Stop waiting to do this celeb. Oh, he has 100,000 followers. He's traveling here and there. He's there and there. He's there and there. He's there and there. And that's why my life. And he, Shut up! And you put in the seeds. Oh, I started crypto trading today. My friend is making more money in Forex. Let me join Forex. Let me join Forex. You join Forex and they fall you away. They send you away. They say, I'm, I'm actually sweating on that AC. That's my problem now. That's, my, that's the problem I have now. That's the problem I have now. Put in the seeds. Boy, oh boy. You don't put seeds. I'm telling you that I am in a phase where I, am, I have built a system on DAPA where if I don't want to work again throughout this year, money can be coming to my account. And I'm not satisfied yet. I'm not. Guess what? By the time those distractions come, they want to take you away from the original plan you set. They want to take you away from the original goals you set. They want to take you away from the original dreams you had. So today you are in Forex. Tomorrow you've joined. I'm not saying it's not good to learn all the skills. But later on, you, you have done so many things and you come back, you did not plant one seed. Because you are busy chasing shadows, chasing corn. You are not ready planting the seed. If you plant the seed in Nafle marketing today, can I tell you to this this year, this year, she goes in Manuel. 
Chigozi Emmanuel has made not less than 4 million naira from crypto. But till today, he has not opened one day and said, ah, I want, to, I want to start crypto class. Guess what? His main money use is starting some bit. You know, I told you he made money from crypto last year. Then the 10 million he got from crypto affiliate marketing, he took capital and went into crypto, fire down. Took some money. He's supposed to launch an app. Do you know this year, he put some about 2 million in a, an affiliate marketing program that has not even yielded money till today, but he's staying there. <laughs> Two million. He said, I made profit. Okay, he gave this one. He gave, even gave a developer. So let's build this so I can make this thing from this program. And the money has not started coming. But he has stayed in power. I remember there was a time when he came to Lagos in this office. This is the office. I'm in my office. When I went to do when I want to do webinars, I stay in my office. This place I am recording is where I sat Chigoze down and I say record a flame marketing course. There was a period where it was $100. He was getting them $65, $65, sixty five, sixty five dollars. <laughs> you I know. You, you've gotten all the costs on Daba to equip yourself. Good. But make sure you have staying power. Staying power is saying, if I've taken all the costs, oh yeah, now let me focus and do this one. Let me get something from this. Let me get something from this. No, but you don't have staying power. And that's why when you see a small challenge, you are off. I saw some, I saw some Daba students. I see their update and I laugh. Like, shit, what are you doing? Is this what you're supposed to do? Is this what you're supposed to be doing? The way your status is, it looks like you've given up already. Where did you join? You just came in February. July, you already given up. Boy, you need stay in power. Stay on that thing. I've been teaching for more than five years, 10 years. I've been teaching. I've been on this shit. I've been on this thing. I've been on this thing. I've been on this thing. Like, I've been on this thing. I've been on this thing. I've been on it. There's a reason why you've got to listen to me in crypto than another person. You know why? I was here when the beer market came. I was here when Bitcoin went from $19,000 to three five. I didn't change my hustle. I kept on saying, buy Bitcoin. <laughs> Stay in power is when the gods are down. Can you still preach that thing you were preaching when there was no money? When you had, when you had money and now there's no money. Can you still say the thing? Can you, can you still say that thing? When Corona season happened, Market crashed. I came back and said, people start buying Bitcoin. I even did a blog and I went, go to my sub stack. You're going to see it there. Chris Ani, several reasons why you should buy Bitcoin during Corona season. Who the, who the hell is smiling today? You've got to develop staying power. I don't know. My AC gets too cold. I'm feeling cold here. Yeah. I'm feeling cold here, yeah, but this brain is not feeling cold. It's crazy, man. It's crazy. But that's what happens when I'm on fire like this. It's crazy. I don't know. I don't know. When I start talking like this, the sweat keeps coming. A man can cheat. He's not even close by. Develop staying power. Now, by the time those distractions come, by the time they come, and by the time you, you pull through, guess what? Even if it's just one thing you could pull through with, guess what? You will go back again and start arranging your vision. But since you do not give up, now, when the like now, I see, do you know today? Eh? Do you know if you go to digitalabundance.io, you will see my company website. At the time, I left all the things that were not bringing money very well. Guess what? Three of our company, three plat four of our platforms now. There was a time when it was only one that was bringing money. There was only one. Later on, the second started bringing money again. 2018 ending, 2019. Second one revived again. I stayed on it. In short, my, 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 my mistake in 2019 was that that second stream of income that brought money, I started going low on it, small, small. 
I didn't know that that was the perfect time when it was low like that, that I would have pumped in more capital, either from different crowdfunding source and make a killing from it. In the seasons, when it looks like things are not working, develop staying power. Also, put on the shield of faith. You know, just like spiritual battles, the Bible calls it the whole armor of God. Another life lesson. When you've tasted poverty, hear me well, 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 so you don't make this mistake. I know you've tasted poverty and you want to be rich, but in the course, in the course of rising, when you start seeing those money, I want to beg you. I can kneel down for you. I want to beg you. Don't get to the level where nobody can talk to you again. Maintain discipline. Don't be like the black man who gets money and really wants to show off to people that yes, there's money and nobody can talk to him again. Some of you are my mentees here listening to me. You know the meaning of what I'm saying. Money. When you are not born in a wealthy family and your money starts coming after you've tasted poverty, you can become rude than the man who was born in a wealthy family. Nobody will tell you this. That's what is killing Hush Poppy. His motivation for greed, his motivation, his motivation. Get this right. Write this down. Your motivation for wealth is the most important. Hush Poppy was a good guy when he was in Lagos. But he said, how can my sister die because of 3-5 in loot? So when that motivation started, there were people who started scamming. And immediately they scammed people. They withdrew and they went back. My mom one time was preaching to a woman, a lady who was a prostitute. And this woman in her street back then in Lagos, one day my mom went into the, they called them, they, they, the brothel they stay. My mom sat with this girl, preached to her. The girl cried. And she told my mom, there's an amount of money I want to save. Once I'm done saving it, I'll leave. Guess what? The day she hit that money, she left. She never came back to prostitution. Don't do it because you may not survive it. And she went on and told my mom she now has a store. And she went back and her life got something better. When your motivation for wealth is to show people that you have arrived, you will miss it. Don't get to that level. Don't get to that level where you say, I can use my money to do anything. That's why Nigeria is where it is today. Because we now have politicians. I am richer than every senator in Nigeria. And I say this to people, say, what do you mean? I say, because those guys, taste. look at Oshomole. Look at some of these guys. They tasted poverty years ago. So what they wanted was a period when they could break through wealth. And they now show people that they can do anything with money. That's why some people become politicians and they can kill people just to retain that wealth. If your motivation for wealth is that, you will, you will stop listening to people, one, two. You, 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 can, you can even kill anybody just to prove a point. Three, even your mentors can't talk to you again. Four, money becomes a controlling factor over vision. Don't get to that level. Poverty is a bastard. People who come from rich family tend to be more disciplined, but people don't know. But those who come from poor family, sometimes the biggest scammers are those from poor family. You know why? They want to prove a point that their generation should never be poor again. That's why Oshpopi is Oshpopi today. Bill Gates. Why is Bill Gates' daughter not thinking of scamming somebody? That's why you must seal, you must you must seal the generational wealth in your family this period. Give yourself the next five years. I told Precious, my daughter, that girl, I told her, I said, 
buy a car for your mom next year. I know I'm telling you to do that. I'm buying a jeep for my mom, for my mentor next year. That girl that earned a million, how much is that car? You do two million, you buy it for your mom. Do it well, do it well. But when your motivation is now, you now get to a level where you, are, you can, you can break a dose. You say my money will do the work. Let's not raise people who are wealthy but don't have value. Don't be a man who is wealthy and you don't have value. That's why today there are some friends I've cut off because they are this level. You know why? They are the face where they have money and you can't talk to them and you can't do anything if it is your money that is controlling you and not your value. I don't bloody care who you are. I will cut off from you. My name is Chris Annie. <laughs> you don't know me. You don't know me. 2017, we came to Lagos looking for 10 million. And then on, I didn't even have up to a million in my account. I was just doing what I was doing. Okay, I think, yeah, I think I had then. I had then. Yes. I, had, I, I made some kind of money like that. And we needed one man to invest in our company. And the man was talking bullshit. Talking down our value. Talking bullshit. I told my partner, I'm getting out of this meeting. I don't have this money, but bullshit to you, sir. I left the meeting. Hey, come back on Friday meeting. I hung the phone on them. That's me. If you can have money and you have value, I'll respect you. But if you don't have money, if you have money and you don't have values, I'll leave you. I'll write my resignation letter, even when I know I may benefit one millionaire from you tomorrow. That's why you can't buy some of us. That's why we, some of us cannot be ass leakers. Make sure you have this thing. It's more than gold. It's more than gold. It's more than gold. If you have this thing, no amount of friend can entice you to scam somebody. If you have this thing, no amount of thing you will see outside, you'll be intimidated by that person's wealth. Rather, you use that person's wealth for motivation and to learn. If you have this thing. Don't be the one whose wealth gets into his head and nobody can talk to you again. Don't use the fear of poverty to be the only motivating factor to make money alone. Go back and write the vision. Today, I'm launching my new, my company website, I'm launching it new, the, plus the five products we have on the subsidiary. And I can tell you, it wasn't easy 2017. It wasn't easy 2018. But I can tell you, I saw battles. And I can tell you, I'm the star up in the sky. I'm the mountain you look up high. I've made it. To my own world, I'm the world's greatest in my own part. And I can tell you, I'm set on this course that I must follow. And I am ready to pursue the vision the way God gave it to me at the original inception. Every dream I had for digital abundance, 2020 is the year I'm bringing things out. And people will be like, what happened? In Igbo language, I told them, eh, meaning they don't know as I take prepare come 2020. For 2017, 2018, 2019, I wasn't complaining even when I was seeing challenges. People were seeing everything well, but they didn't. I wasn't complaining. Another thing you must do in the season when things aren't working so fine, remain with a heart of gratitude. If you are the type that, see, see, it is this year I want to even stop that thing. I am that kind of friend where you give me water, water. I'll be praising you till Jesus come. I will, you will give me water. Water. I will put you on my status. I will, I will praise you. Do you know that the, the, the that's why till today I like all the, it's like all the cars I've using, everything black, black Jeep. The first Jeep I ever bought, what happened? I didn't use it for four, five months. I was driving the Bejuleki. Next thing I said, let me turn. Next thing I lost control of the car. Next thing I was just shouting, Jesus, Jesus. I came out of the car. Car pieces. And we're saying, bring 300,000 to repair now. Or 500,000, 1 million. Let's repair the car. 
I said, don't worry. I came back, I was shouting, thank you, Jesus. <laughs> I was considering that I spent three million buying a car. <laughs> I was saying, thank you, Jesus. Woo! I'm alive. I'm alive. Life works in me. I'm alive. Thank you, Jesus. There are times where you see me on Facebook or WhatsApp or Twitter. I just say, thank you, Jesus. You know why? At that moment, I'm just feeling a heart of gratitude. There are, you won't know whether there was a challenge. You will not know. I'm the one telling you now. So you don't think life is a bed of roses. Boy, boy, I keep on saying thank you. We will do 50,000 in sales. I will be happy. I'll say, thank God, we even have money that we used to run the next advert. We even have money we could use to pay salary. This year, I told myself that if I don't even make any money, as long as I'm paying, paying those millions in salaries and royalty, I'm okay. As long as I have what to eat. <laughs> and my vibe is going. Because the more you are, that's why some of you, some of you are like that. You are, you are bad at gratitude. You are not good at it. That's why when somebody even sends you 5,000, instead of you to call the person on phone and say thank you, if you're sending, you sending you a text, thank you, thank you. Last two weeks, last week, an extended relation of mine called me. Hey, they caught, they caught my brother. Police, oh, police, oh, police. They called my five times. I said, okay, what's the issue? So I called one of my, in Lagos, there's one, one of my ogre came to my launch. The day I launched my orb in Lagos, 2018. He said, any policeman that touches you, just call me. I mean, anywhere in this Lagos. So when they said one of my relations was in trouble, I reached out to him. He asked me one question. What did they see in his phone? Ah! I discovered that the boy, somebody was trying to bring the boy into Yahoo Yahoo. He didn't tell his parents. He didn't, he didn't tell his mom. His dad is late. He did not tell his sister. So when I called, they were lying to me. But when I now called the boy, he now told me the truth. And I now called police. Of course, your Nigerian police know what they do. So when they were arresting the boy, they, they, they said they would bring money. They need money. money. Mother couldn't bring money. And now I was the one who they called. I sent money. I said, okay, release the boy. See, he said. And I'm going. The next thing was I, I planned that, okay, this boy, I'm going to bring him and I'm going to start training him. We're going to give him free courses on DABA so I will learn graphic design. And I'm going to train him. But guess what? After he was released, till today, They've not called me to say thank you. <laughs> People who don't have gratitude don't know what they block for themselves. I tell you, it's, it's shocking to you. At the time, I said that someone was saying I should call them and know if I said okay. <laughs> gratitude. Don't be the one who is always going to the mentor, collecting from the mentor. How gratitude. So look at this wristwatch. Do you know how the likes of Cheta, Precious, those guys are in my heart. She goes here. Oh boy, I'm not saying everyone should come and do the same thing. So one, last week I saw Andalin just sent one kind of flyer to me. She designed my, my, my course and some double course in a mock-up. I appreciated that stuff. I didn't know that a friend of mine who wanted to something, just I have contacts. Like, I have contacts. I mean, I have one, over 1,000 people that if I tell them, let's buy some, let them buy something and they are interested, they will buy. So, somebody now said, I want. On the thing I posted, and I said, okay, it is Andalin that designed that. I gave her Andalin's number. So I didn't know the guy wanted to design a website. So the guy now had to message Andalin. Andalin now had to refer him back to one of my boys who wanted to be the website. Even then, the, my boy finished striking the deal and the boy paid 60, 50%. My boy called me. Sir, I've not said a website, though, but we'll finish the deal. I want to send you money now. Gratitude. Gratitude. There's a guy, the guy who designed this flyer, his name is Nobu. The guy who designed this. I have three graphic designers. 
I told him, I said, I'm going to get you 10 clients. Me, I will do it. You know why? He's an intern with us. He took Daba course. I gave him Daba course for free. He, he, he upgraded his designs. Damola was on who linked him to me. And the boy has been loyal. The boy has been loyal. I was watching him since last year. There are times he would design something for me because he came through Damola. So sometimes he would design something for me. I just, I, I kept on watching the guy. Watching the guy. Watching the guy. He was, he wanted his way. Why? And last week I told him, I'll get you 10 clients. And these 10 clients will put nothing less than 100K in your account. I will get you. Gratitude. In the seasons, don't be among those. There was a guy yesterday. Don't be among this person doing this. Yesterday, he sent me a voice note and an emergency message. Say, I need five people that will join this team. Though. Probably wanted to sell his Forex program or something. And how will you be sending me a mentor to buy your talk? I I, I be sending me broadcast. I don't need it. You did it the first time. You did it the second time. And this one, I said, please, can you stop sending me these notes? Guess what the boy did? He blocked me. And when he blocked me, I sent him a message. I said, you're mad. You're stupid. How can you block me because I did not buy from you? How can you, how can you block me? How? Why? Why? I'm not your customer. You should be learning from me. If you learn from me, you will not be sending people broadcasts. Because my WhatsApp course alone has taught people how to make millions. I mean, I'm a very, I'm, I, I'll attack you. Me? If, I, if you're my friend, if you're my friend, not the, if you're my friend or you're my protege or you are my mentee or you're my student and I truly have your interest at that, I won't be smiling. I, I won't smile with you all the time. If you do something that is, of, that is not good, me, I will not go and talk at your back. I will call you and say, hey, shut up, guy. What the hell? Who, who the hell are you? Come on, you did this thing wrong. Let's trash it. And I corrected the boy immediately. I sent him a text message. Guess what? The guy had to unblock me and came back. Said, Mr. Chris, hey, I don't need that type of energy. I can't be rejected. I don't need that. Type of... I said, shut up. Have you received rejection? Me, that flew five times from Kano to Lagos to come and see investor. Investor no give, no even give me one error. Five times. I was flying. There was a time we were flying from Kano to Lagos. The the, the, the plane on the shake. Oh boy. At that time, I started remembering that God is good. Hey, God. <laughs> I like At the time, when, I was, when, when I'm in the plane, I know when the pilot wants to land. In short, when you go from Lagos to Kano, eh, 30 minutes into the journey, eh, landing has started. And the way the plane will start descending, you will know. You will think the plane won't crash. The plane will be asking on the free fall for 30 minutes. Oh boy. Does he do that thing? Did that thing, eh? In my mind, I already said, no, I'll not die. I have, I have purpose to fulfill. Plenty people they wait for me. Don't worry, I'm not gonna die. <laughs> Even if this plane crash, I will disappear. <laughs> it's blood. That plane, I need to develop IBP. After all those work. There was a pilot one investor said they want to see us, they want to see us. Guess what? <laughs> that plane, that morning, that morning. Came down. Nothing. They see they tell us story. I did not abuse the man. Today I'm still friends with the man. I still did some things for the man. One day the man called me and said I should help him do a design. I did not collect money. I went to give my graphic design. I said, design it. Now our job. I do it like I see it. Because as you keep rising, even if people reject you today, still maintain relationship. Because the people who may not buy today can do something for you tomorrow that is more than just buying for you today. Don't block certain doors. You know, poverty and challenges can make some weakness or some angry part of you come out. Yes, it can happen. Huh? Some challenges can make you rude. Some challenges can make you exhibit some negative attitude. I'm not saying I am perfect. Some of you have chatted with me before. And maybe you chatted when I was angry. And I replied to you one kind. 
There's a lady today, there's a lady today, her name is Jessie. Maybe she's in this call, I don't know. One day, I, I, she reached out to me about something. So I now can't say that, that no, now you don't need to be like that to people. Guess what? It didn't reach up to two weeks. This girl came and started arguing with me on something. So I became angry because I was in an angry mood. She was arguing with something I posted on my status. And I said, look at, is that the, that's the reason why the other person did this to you? You know, me I said that. I was in an angry mood. I blocked her. Me I blocked her. Sometimes I said, Chris, I know the, what the girl said was bad. But no, 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 this was too fast. You two calm down. That's why you need, you need, you need that humble spirit. You need that spirit that she tells you, even when you make a mistake, be ready to admit the mistake. The problem we have in the world today is that we have leaders and people who even when they make a mistake, they're not ready to admit the mistake. You are human, you make mistakes, but do you admit you've done wrong? Guess what? I had to send that message. I said, please, I'm sorry. Don't have the kind of money that I'm making not to tell somebody I'm sorry. I know, I know a friend I cut off from this year because he could not use the word I'm sorry. Some of you may know him. No, 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 you don't, you don't do that. Some relationship have not stayed well today because husband refused to say I'm sorry. There's a time my late father and my mom, they will quarrel. My dad will be the one at fault. I learned it from my dad. He'll be the one at fault. Hey! So, in a way to, you know, men have ego now. So the next thing he will do is, <laughs> he will dress up, he will tell my mom, he will tell my mom, I'm sorry inside the bedroom. Will now come and, you know, so that you don't know that your dad is saying, I'm sorry, all those things. The next thing, you know, Popsi don't bribe Momsi for that night. The next morning, we think say Momsi and Popsi and Momsi see the fight. Popsi don't tell Momsi, enter Benz. She end, that time, 230 Benz. The next thing, my mom is coming back with clothes, new bed sheets. Ah, uh-uh. we will go on the other side. We don't go agree. We don't go agree. Momsi don't. They don't bribe Momsi. Finish. Momsi. Momsi. Momsi don't change. And the relationship moves on. And the relationship moves on. I learned it. I saw it. People keep saying I'm a good husband material. Yes, that's why you must mind the kind of environment you were raised into. Not if, if a man says I'm sorry to the wife, he did not remove one bit from you. So, sometimes, even when you are right, tell the woman I'm sorry. Ah, tell her I'm sorry, bribe her. She too, she will know. And when you win a woman like this, she will serve you. Except if you go and marry the one that is an Instagram madness person, like the ones we are seeing these days. Mind the one you are married. Not the one that will go and, you know, go and marry the one. You don't know the one that is mentality there. If you don't buy, if you don't buy wig today, she has finished you. She won't cook. It's not those type of ones she marry. Marry the one that is cool headed. Please, I'm begging you. I'm not married yet, but I know this lesson. And you people will shock when I send my wedding IV to all of you. The things I know about. <laughs> Let's not turn this into a marriage class. <laughs> Before somebody here will call Chris Andy to launch a marriage course. <laughs> I'm telling you, you know, you know, I'm a, I'm a father, if in case you don't know, I have five younger ones who I'm training. So sometimes I'll make my younger ones angry. I'll holler at them. I'll still be the one to tell my brother. Last week, I made my brother angry. I, I still told him, bro, I'm sorry. Because you're at the end of operations. He's the one who takes care of. I don't even, all the receipt for my car, everything, I don't even know anything about it. All I know is that I just have a car that gives the key. He does the operations for so many things. And my mom, too. So I know what it means as a fact. You know when you pay school fees, you buy a laptop, you do this, responsibility is what makes a man. Not because you can't say I'm sorry. That's what makes you. Know when to say I'm sorry. In the relationship, we are, it can be with your boss. Even you as a boss, if you offended an employee, you can call the person and say, this thing I did, I'm sorry about it. Let's work together. You've won the loyalty of that person. People, you can be hard on people. And if you think you'll be hard on them forever, they can change one day. Maybe it was, I'm sorry, that would have changed Obaseki and Oshomole stuff together. Maybe. 
and they will retain the AO APCT. But look at two of them. Oshimule is trying to claim rights. And he's saying that, that this Obaseki knows you from even before he became governor. I was surprised that the deputy of Obaseki, who was a core loyalist of Shomole, could lead. It means there was something you guys, these guys have done that they can't stand again. You can't maltreat people for long. You can't. Don't be a military leader. Be an influential leader. Be a leader that people can come to and say, boss, see what they do me. Don't be the one where they will come around. And there's a way they look at you and you can push it them away. Learn to use the word, I'm sorry. Learn to be a person of gratitude. If you live your life this way, you are building wealth. Wealth isn't just in the accumulation of money. There are people with money who are useless. Look at. Maintain these values. Maintain these values. Maintain these values. You will need them tomorrow. Remember what we've been teaching today. Life lessons. Life lessons. This is a series I'm starting. In short, my book is launching next month. I'm going to write a book next. I'm, I'm working on a book already. 30 lessons are 30. So it's a book for my birthday. 30 lessons are 30. And I'll keep updating. And they will come with video classes. Because young people have to know these things so that you don't cut short destiny at this phase. Don't. With this thing, add these virtues. Add these virtues. When you believe in your vision, when you become rugged with it, be a person of gratitude. Be a person of gratitude. Be a person that recognizes the mistake. Guess what? That girl, that girl, that same girl, I went to tell I'm sorry. Today, she's the one canvassing for people to vote for me. Over 200 votes today for the contest we're doing on Binance. You don't know how life... You, that you have the money doesn't mean you figured out life. We're all learning. We're all students. We're all students in this journey. The same girl I told I'm sorry last two weeks is the same girl that says she's going to go around and get people to vote for me, that she must get 200 votes. What are you learning? I'm documenting these things in videos because I need to let you people know there are people who need this. You've got it. All the money doesn't mean you've got everything figured out. Life, life, life can be funny. <laughs> life can be funny. I woke up one day, and the next day I had that my dad had passed on to glory. Strong. That was the first time they said he, have, he has ever stayed in an hospital for more than 24 hours. The first time in his life he stayed in an hospital for more than 24 hours. He stayed one week and he passed on. Life is crazy. At every face you see, remain humble. Sometimes, sometimes, there's a level of money you hit. Go around people who don't have and interact with them. It will give you a sense to know that this thing you got, even as much as you worked for it, you were also privileged. Life lessons. Are you all getting something tonight? Let me know in the comment section. Are you all getting something tonight? Let me know in the comment section. Let me know in the comment section. Let me know in the comment section. I have, I, have, um, I have 20 more, 15 more minutes to go. We'll all get in the comment section. Don't create wealth to bully people. Don't. Don't create wealth. That's why Nene, we, they have all the millionaires they have. Nene, I'm an evil man. They have all the mil millions they have. They go to parties and they spray all kinds of millions of dollars. And yet, there are people there who are unemployed and they can't even have lights because people's money are just for show off. Don't allow your money be just for show off. Don't. Don't. If you make a mistake, if you make a mistake, if you make a mistake, what makes you human and a true leader is the ability to sit down and say, I made this mistake. You know, we're in a world today that wants people to be perfect. No, 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 no. I didn't tell you to come here perfect. 
be you, be you, be you. Don't come, don't come and exhibit perfection. It's the reason why people who rape people don't want to apologize and they want to use courts to fight it because they have money. That's why the world is messed up. You should, you, you should have, you should have just told the girl, I'm sorry, and plead the parents, and that court case is done. But you want to prove, and that's why some people have gone into extreme feminism and it has brought about hate. Not because you can't say sorry, not because you, the issue cannot die, but because you can't say sorry. Even Jesus said, at the time the disciple asked, at the time the, the, the disciple asked and said, and said, Jesus, how many times are we going to forgive our neighbor? And he said, 70 times, 77 times. But you see, the world wants you to be so perfect, but I'm telling you, don't be perfect. Be you. Be you. Be you. Be you. Be the word who can say, I'm sorry. I'm sorry that I've saved a lot of lives. The reason why politicians are fighting today is because some of them don't want to say, I'm sorry. And guess what? They, they have people they injure in the process. Let your wealth. I want to give you this assignment tonight. Write down seven reasons why you want to be wealthy. Write down. Let me give you a clue. Let me give you a clue. Let me give you a clue. I pray that some of you here, my, 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 my prayer for you tonight, my prayer for you tonight is that as you write, God will give you wisdom. God will open your eyes to the main reasons why your wealth, why you need to be wealthy. Number one for me is for the kingdom of God. I want to expand this kingdom. People spend money on... The pornography industry is a billion dollar industry. People are spending money for it. I need to spend money for God's kingdom. I'm telling you. I want to send money to 1,000 missionaries and they can be in India, in Pakistan, everywhere they are with the kingdom. And they are changing lives. And you could say, Chris, are you a church boy? Yes, I'm a church boy because God himself saved me many times. Many times. No, no, I'm not telling you I'm a church boy that is a church here. No, I'm a kingdom person. I'm not telling you, no, 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 no. I'm, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a person who's a proud, saved soul. I am. I believe that God exists. I believe in the death and the resurrection of Jesus Christ. I believe that he died to save mankind. I believe that our money must go into this work so that people can hear the gospel and they can change lives. I'm just imagining maybe there was somebody who did not preach to Hush Puppy to have changed his life. But there was somebody who preached to a boy called Billy Graham. <laughs> maybe. Maybe. Just maybe. Just maybe. Just maybe. Just maybe there was somebody who did not preach to Billy Graham or Pastor Ia Deboe. All these things people are saying, cult, cult, cult. There's a way to solve it. It's the gospel. There are people who are deep in cocaine. There are people who are deep in prostitution. Who our kingdom ought to be changing. But we're not doing it because we're not putting in our money for it. And number two reason I want to be wealthy is for my family. I want to take care of my family. I want to leave generational wealth for the Anis. Anis. Is that name called Ani? Chris Annie, a time should come, you can enter a bank and collect one million. And they say it's because of Chris Annie. And, 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 and you don't need loan, the name alone. You say, ah, Chris, uh, somebody is here. He said he knows you. I say, yes, who is he? Give him that good. How many is, how much? 100 million. Give him, uh, he will pay. Oh, Chris Annie, video call, you, yes, he will pay. And by then, I built a multi mansion in my village in Enugu with solar energy and the Tesla cars all around, and maybe another car, whatever, using solar energy. I'll be there. And the streets in my village all tied with 
super lights and laboratories in my village. You think I'll go and build it in Dubai? God punish the devil. I'll build it in Nigeria. Yeah, I'll go to Dubai and make money. I'll go to Dubai and connect. We'll build it. We'll build it in Enugu. You can put your own in Ogun State. You can put your own in... See, we'll, we'll, see let me, we'll change this nation. China was once like us. We'll change it. We'll put that laboratory. We'll put the ed educational center. We'll build the library. I'll put it there. I need library. Put it in my Enugu town there. Put the name. We need well to do those things. Not this type of money misroad some of these billionaires in Nigeria have. A wealth that changes life. I want to build wealth for that. Number two is my fault. Number three also for people. For people. There are more scholarships to give. There are more projects. To, for my company too. More money. I also want to make wealth to for governance sake, for governance and politics sake. Because a time will come, a time will come when we need to put a new governor in that state. Just call Chris and I'll call 10 of my men who we'll raise 20 billion for the campaign because we know that guy is good. We will use money and campaign. And we, because we have, we have the money and we have the value, we will use that money and campaign. Somebody say, Godfather. Yes, it happens. Yes. Everything you do, there's a Godfather somewhere. Trump was sponsoring Hillary Clinton when, when Hillary Clinton was not even anything yet. But people don't know. People don't know why Trump talks to any of these politicians anyhow. While he was in business, he used to say, they used to come to him for money. Money can put you in a place of influence. That's why politicians are doing rubbish. Look at Aki Alabi with his billions. He buys Transformer today. He buys this. That's one of the exemplary guy. And he's a Muslim. He's a Muslim. He's even doing better than some people who go to church. He buys this. He gives scholarship. How many senators in Nigeria? There was an outage today. How many of these senators can you reach in Nigeria? And tell them, and tell them, sir, I don't have school fees and they will pay. But, you see, wealth, number three is to lift people out of poverty. Number four is for governance and politics. That's my own. I don't know your own. I don't know your own. Somebody says, surprise, no, Akian Labi is a Muslim. Let me tell you something. Let me, there's, a, there's, a, there's a level of exposure you get. You notice there are certain things that you don't have to do because of religion. He's actually a Muslim, uh, but he goes to church, but people don't know. <laughs> but his, his father was a Christian. His father was a Christian. He goes to church. Yeah, there's a way that man does this. He even goes to say, he can even go to select today. <laughs> but if I'm wrong, maybe you guys can correct me later. Influence. Influence. Then I also want to make money to enjoy my life, fool. <laughs> Boy, I want to enjoy life. <laughs> like... Where is this guy? Where is this basketballer? This basketballer, or what's this basketballer's name? That Kobe Bryant passed the batting to. Hey, that's the best guy. See, James, James, James. LeBron James, LeBron. LeBron spends no less than $2 million on his health yearly. <laughs> LeBron spends no less than $2 million on his health. On his health. God will punish poverty. You. you know, there's a picture of this. Uh, 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 what's his name? There's a place called Fiji Island. Let's, let's, let, let me take you. Let me, let me take you guys to some place while we're here in our Nigeria or anywhere you are. 
<laughs> ah, oh boy, oh boy. <laughs> ah, you know, you know, you know, you, 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 you've got to make money to enjoy this life. <laughs> Poverty is a bastard. There's a place called Fiji Island. Okay, this is Fiji Island. <laughs> Let me inspire you tonight. You know, I've been telling people Dubai, Dubai. Let's go to Fiji Island. Let's travel to Fiji Island a bit. Let's travel to Fiji Island a bit. You know, at some, you know sometimes I don't like wearing these clothes. And we're there with our boxers. And we're there on water, natural water. And we're just there. If any sickness catch you for that place, come, I'll give you your money back. Sick waiting. Sick? Are you crazy? You are even your village people. By that you fly, enter Fiji Island, they will leave you. <laughs> they will leave you. You want to make money to enjoy your life. Okay? You want to make money to enjoy your life. Let me show you something on, on, on YouTube. <laughs> woo! Woo, 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 I'm telling you, you better be rich. This should be the things. God, God is not against you flexing. Write it down. God is not against you flexing. I'm telling you, I'm, I'm going to repeat it again. You can be on court. God, look at this place. Tony Robbins. In his Fiji apartment. I thought you could see one day to check how much. To buy a resort like this, they are sold for $200,000. They are sold for $1 million. Fiji. He has, Tony Robbins has house in different places in the world, though. I'm so in love with the people here that I decided I want to have a piece of this and I want to find a way to bring people here. This is a place you go for resorts just to, I mean, I'll just take the likes of Chigozie, Precious, Andrew. I'll take all these, my Dabba mentees. I say, okay, like 50 of us. You guys will join me. You put enter private jets. Look at home. Look at this place. Are you see? Is there any for security? A heaven in Fiji Island. He bought this place at twenty nine. I like to make something that feels like it's very relaxed. See relaxation. Scale of things is my scale size. Shares. Just look at. What's your favorite spot? I'll show you one of them. I'll show you. Buy a place near the law, near the old God of Heaven. Don't die of depression, no. The last uh, storm took Don't me. die of. You know, this could have let out to rest. Upstairs bed. I'm on top of the building. See Fiji Island. You know, I love to hang out up here. Where you, How will you be in this type of place? You will not write a book well. No, some of you will never make money for affiliate marketing now because maybe you did one location where you did. They even run out and they do you one kind. You're always around people that are discouraging you. Look at. Kind of a bargain back then. Just did, you have, did you have to fight? When you got this property, and it was owned by a group of professors from Scripps Oceanography, and they didn't have enough money to build strong. The reason for wealth. Is also <laughs> to enjoy your life. <laughs> the purpose of wealth is also to enjoy your life. Don't die, say the hustle. Enjoy your life. I'm telling you, I had that thing. I, I said, taking my. You know, some of you say to buy drugs is uh, maybe is a, is a bad thing. No, no, no. I mean, LeBron James, 
Cristiano Ronaldo, they spend money on their health. You get a trainer, you know. Some of you, some of us don't do exercise because you have to make money every day. You know, you have a trainer who is always pushing. You have machine, that's every your legs, your body. Cristiano Ronaldo was so tired of coronavirus that he went to Portugal and decided and decided to go and stay in the island, him and his family, <laughs> in case the whole world catches coronavirus. <laughs> Take care of your body. Take care of your health. And if you're a man, okay, you know, okay, family is also there, your wife. But if you're a man, as a man, okay, on that list of families, still put your wife. You know, let your wife to eat your money. Don't be a kagom. Don't be among those giving 2,000 naira for soup. Abba, remove that poverty. Even you, if you go on my cars, go chop. In 2,000 feet, you finish. But you give your wife 2,000 naira for food. Reject that poverty now. How much be, be how much be 2,000 naira go and buy Bitcoin? Not even reach $10. Not even reach $4. Yet you tell the woman that that soup you cook, put it in the fridge, let it last for three days. Please, that's why you must create wealth. So that those mistakes, you won't be there struggling. Enjoy your life. Buy, buy good car. I tell you, the, the car I bought this year, I loved it. Like I was eyeing it, the leather seat, everything. I was in, I was loving it. You know that so when I go inside, I'll be doing get you got that yummy, yummy, yummy. You don't know I like Justin Bieber now. Hey, give your wife good money to buy cook good food so that you can eat plenty meat inside the soup. Not when you eat one meat, you're looking for the next meat. As if you are in the ocean. Mm, ah, fish has finished. Fish don't finish. Where is the fish now? Oh, God, now 2,000. You almost go bring stone as fish. Even Jesus had to use fish to give to many. He didn't do no, no, no. Don't remove, remove that poverty. Remove it. Reject it. Hmm? Some of you are experiencing that kind of thing in school. Eh? Eh, you go there, you, you, you are your roommate. Now cook. By the time you finish, by the time you finish cooking, you are still scraping the pot to finish the real food. May the Lord deliver you. Now that ask you, now that Corona make money. So before you go back to school, who say you can't go back to school and have your own flat and be cooking? Eh? Not every time in the night, in the night, in the night, you say, no, no, no. I don't want to stress. I don't want stress in cooking. I lie, money no day. No, you lie, say you want stress. Say, I don't have stress. I don't want to cook. I don't want to cook. It's the kind of money that comes in there. You even fill your room with enough food stuff. You eat. When you eat where well, you think well. Not when you be in school, they will, they will tell you how far, how far, you say you want to go back home. Now you're at home, make money now. So when you go back to school, you can be sending them money at home. Not asking them to send Gary, send rice. You, then you buy, you stock, you eat. You enjoy your life. Eh? Please. So you can be thinking where. So you can be thinking where. Some even go as as eating indomie and, indomie and bread so they'll, they'll be filled. Not for nutrients. Not for nutrients. You are know, eating. You know, that's why your eyes do like this. Your eyes do like this. Do like this. Your eyes is time to read. It's time to read. You do like this. You say you go to night class. You're not sleep. You, you, you were sleeping. You didn't read. You say, you know, you are not reading anything. I went to night class. I went to night class. Night class kill you there. You were sleeping. Why? You were indomie bread and 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 and, and la casera boom so that the body will be now hunger they do you no go read you no read don't don't be deceiving yourself <laughs> okay and that's it and that's it your motivation look for more motivations for world another 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 assignment Write down the name of your dream company and what you want to do. 
It can be a company. It can be a non, an NGO. It can be a movement. But tonight, I trust that God will plant in your spirit something. An idea will come. I was in Delta when the idea came for digital abundance. And the time when I was praying, I said, it's time for me to move to Lagos. I wanted to go to Uyo. Uyo was the place. They're saying, tech, 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 tech. And I said, go to Lagos. And I was pushing the clients I was gotten. And I wrote it. When I wrote Digital Abundance, I went to check CAC. Nobody had it. Nobody. My prayer tonight, may that idea rest in your spirit. That you will know purpose. You will know it. You will know what to do. You will know. You will know the, the path to go on. We have so many confused people who are young. Young people are confused. There's no direction. Let me tell you, any man that gives you direction in life, hold that person. Hold that person. Hold that person. Because we're in a generation where people are distracted by what they see rather than what is inside their body. Tonight, buy a note, get a note, call it my vision note, my purpose note. Write the names of the company you're running now. Call yourself that CEO, even if it's 10,000 you are making weekly. Call yourself the chairman of that company. Visualize how you're going to have people buy from you. How you're going to sell to the world. How you're going to travel. I want to make money because I love traveling. I know you go say we'll be with me, then we'll build we'll in our private jet. We'll customize it like Grand Cadon. We'll put it there, CA. It's not that about CA, Chris Annie. See that my logo? Put it there. I'll be doing video inside my jets. Traveling. I want to be in that place. But today, uh, start with Jeep. Start with that small car. Start. Start, even if you don't have a car, start learning how to enter Uber and pay. Don't join this people in Lagos and be struggling for boss. That is, that is a mentality. Let me tell you, even me, the time when the money never come, I started even entering those things like that. Even when I did, okay, that's why I even bought my car then. I was entering, I was entering, I was entering the thing. It's a mentality, enter Uber. Let AC blow you. It's not every time you be inside Lagos. Oh, wow, oh, wow, oh, wow. Oh, balende, oh, balende, oh, balende. Ah, don't be stoned. This life is not hard. I can't even remember the last time I was fighting with any conductor in this life. Eh? Every time, obey the main market, obey the main market. Only goes, only goes, oga up, oga up, oga up, oga up, oga up every time. Enter taxi. I know it's 10,000 you're making. Remove 2,000. Enter. That's in, that's in, there's a man. See, if your, if this thing, if your mentality can be conditioned, I'm telling you. One day I told some of my staff that you are entering, that you don't have car, doesn't mean you should, you should, you should be entering boss. She be one, go and tap boss. They can't rob him, collect him phone. I'm not saying they can't rob him in this thing. But, enter, enter the taxi. Let AC blow your head. Let AC blow your head. Even that your house, save 50,000, 60,000. Buy AC sometimes. You know, every time, hot fan, hot fan. You know, you know there are some fan that blow heat. Then buy AC. Let your brain cool. You know, AC even helps your skin to be fresh. You know, every time, you think it's cream that's making me fresh. I stay in AC a lot of times. A cool environment. Yeah. So like, you'll be inside, you'll be... <sighs> yellow, are you not tired of yellow boss in Lagos? I'm not saying you should rush yourself. It's a process. Two months in a while, before you know, the thing changes. I know that. Your health, your family, your wife, your business, your, 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 your community. Go back. There are some of you in the village now. You know that your village, that you one day you can carry one million 
or 10 million and go back to the village and say, I'm giving 50 students scholarship. Go and do it. You can build a healthcare center in your community. You can. Start doing it now. Start. I have something, a new course I'm launching on Daba in the next 10 days. And I feel this is one of the perfect times to talk about it. I don't know if Michael has done, but let me check if the link is, if the link is open already. And if the link is open, then it means we're all good to go with this. How many of you tonight, you've gotten something? How many of you? Let me sit in the comment section. You've gotten something tonight. Let me sit in this comment section. So prepare this year. I'm going to hold a boot camp. I'm going to hold a boot camp this year. It's going to be a live boot camp. Okay, so that's what I'm telling you to enter all these things now. Enter the taxi file so I can be spent. You know, sometimes, you know, when, when Corona said to cut that 50,000, enter plane. You know, Bible said far above principalities and power. By the time you enter that plane, even your village will say, oh boy, this boy don't pass us. They, 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 you'll be telling your village people, <laughs> bye bye, because you know, you cannot say granite in the airport. Yeah, you can't say granite in the office. You, 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 you don't say gala la casera in, in, in where you are flying. <laughs> you don't. You don't say la casera. You don't. You don't say la casera. You don't. You, you don't. But when you are in yellow bus, you gala 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 gala. You don't give my change. Nobody does that when you are on plane there. Thank you, Jesus, for tonight. I know that. Well, well, well. Now, I want, I want to plead. I want to do some. I want to ask you for just one thing. One thing. One thing. Every one of you here who are part of this webinar, from today, let it not be known that we share something that we teach, help people, and you don't share it on your status. Don't be like that. Look at Tasha. Look at all these Bibi Niger people. What is the value they are giving out? And yet you see their people everywhere retweeting, sharing like mad. But we that have the main stuff, our own people who are impacting are silent. No matter how much, do you know this past, our, our ad budget for the past, by, by, by next week we make it 30 days, is 1 million naira. For my company, 1 million, 30 days, 1 million. By next month, you're increasing it again. Once the department will be increasing 1.5, next we go to two, like that. I mean, that's what I spend on ads. But the matter I spend on ads, the one you reach to is powerful. That your friend that you tell about on the WhatsApp status. Okay, that knows about it through you. That person's life can be changed. Somebody invited Jimo Ibrahim to one of the Kodepo's meeting. Somebody, his life changed. You don't know the person you're bringing to Daba. Your income, one thing about it is that when you meet me, your income will change. Ask Chigozie now. There's a time it was just one million. One point. There's, a, there's a time Chigozie was within a program, how I made 1.5 million. Ask Chigozie how much he has done this year. Just one year meeting me, just one year. I mean, this boy has sold Bitcoin worth over 100 million to people. So as a middleman. I know the grace God has given to me. Write this down, another assignment. I said it last week and I'm saying it again. Write down your uniqueness, your strength the things you are good at, write it down, those strengths. Write it down. Write it down. Write those things you can do, those your uniqueness, write it down.
Write it down. Write it. List those strengths. We need to keep emphasizing this thing because when a generation where people are using hustling mentality to forget that some of the things they can do are coming from things who are just some of the money they need to make is coming from are coming from their strength. I'm a born teacher. It's not, and I've been on fire like this. And I know my energy. So I know that people need to pay me for this and connect with me for this. What, is the, what are those things that will attract people to you? It could be a new skill you built. It could be a new career. It could be a, a uniqueness, a gift, a talent. It could be something you're passionate about. It could be a business you're building. And there's a unique thing about that business. You will do, you will write a book, people will buy from you. You will write about book, people will buy from you. But another person will write about book, they won't look at it like that. It's uniqueness. I can go on and on and on and on and on and on and on to teach. But let me give these updates. So we have, we have, uh, where are they? We have four people who are nominating for Daba Student of the Month. And these people, uh, I'm going to share, some of you keep asking questions is, how does this Daba thing work let me share with you you see this guy called duca duca has done uh he has done over uh he did over thirty thousand rands in june put it in naira that's over several eight hundred thousand almost a million naira this one and guess what he only watched the day one of internet money conference and and you know, took the WhatsApp course. They one day, two day, three, and took the WhatsApp course. Some of you are asking for WhatsApp course PDF. I will not release this because the day I will see 200 people do flyers. And I see it on the start and I see that. Uh, and I now say, okay, I can do a flyer. I don't I need to exercise my body. So my, I say my hand is feeling. Number two, precious. It's precious in this in this in this meeting. The precious share that challenge with me this 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 today how the goods are, are goods from China have not landed for some reasons. But in June, Precious did over 500,000 Naira. I think so from Bitcoin trading. And she did a class for more than 30 people, paid class. Then the man, Belo. Belo is a, is a great guy. Is Belo in this call? Is he in this video class? Belo is a great guy. He's been referring people at Daba. Like he opened a page, he opened a website, he opened a Facebook page, because you know, for everybody you refer on Daba, you get 10%. And he took a affiliate marketing course. And we have, oh, Steph, Steph, Steph. Steph sold herself to us. Steph came to me like some of you today but she did something different. You think Steph has all the money in the world. She doesn't. I was surprised one day we, we sent Steph something and the Alachi, the way Steph screamed, I was even scared. I said, how much is this money now that you're screaming? Stephanie Ronald, great girl. First time I finished teaching like this, the next, that week, she went to do a webinar, she went to do a video. I love the video. All my, some of my guys are like, some of you ask me, is she single, blah, blah, blah. Hey, hey, what's oh, this girl, this girl, this girl. Can she do a video for us? And she did it in that one. And the way she was improving. The one I loved most was the one she did for my birthday. You can see the recent one. And Steph now has an accountability group. 
where if you want to achieve your goals, you come there, she will follow you up. I don't know, is Steph in this class? Some people are not in this class tonight. Then blessing. Now let me say something. I'll use one word to summarize what's blessed. Blessing is the first lady that has earned over five hundred dollars from affiliate marketing, and she's the first lady from Daba. So, guys, the contest is hot. Is hot. It's hot. It's hot. This one. This one. This one. This one. This one. So. Now, when people say, how do we select? That's how we select. I look at your performance. You see, I, I see your progress in our WhatsApp groups. See what you're doing. I may not be able to monitor everybody because the time will come, I can't, I can't see 10,000 students. But maybe we'll start giving students per course, per group. You know, it will go like that. Then the one from this group, the one from this group, the one from this group, it will be seven and it will now be by, via voting. And that's why today, if you're here, you don't have a Twitter account. Go and open one. Imagine if I don't have a Twitter account. And look at what has happened. CZ has followed me. Binance CEO has followed me. I'm up for a contest. Whether I'm going to win or not, is not going to thing. This contest showed me that I have cost impact in people. No, no joke. My, my Facebook friends showed me. I've been building my Facebook. for My Instagram paying me. But you see Facebook, I so love it. In the past 24 hours, I've gained more than 1,000 followers on Facebook and on Twitter. Grow your social media account today. Grow it. If you don't know anything to post, post everything Christian is teaching. Start with that. As you continue to do, ideas will come to your spirit. So remember the assignment. Seven reasons why you should be wealthy. Um, the next, the next, the next is get the vision notes, write these things there, put up the visions, the dream. Like me, I have Blue Valley, I have Digital Abundance. So I look at Digital Abundance, I look at Digital Abundance and the four companies under Digital Abundance, number one, Crypto, number two, Daba, number three, Crypto Life Capital, number four, Nigerian Bitcoin Exchange. I do, we trade. Now, one of the guys, I think one of the things, one of the guys who is bringing in more money now to my company for our extra, we're building an, an app, is Chigose Emmanuel. And app are going to used to be selling Bitcoin. We're about to go crazy in that area. Buying and selling BTC. We're going to launch an app and join Bitcoin Exchange. It's on course. My crypto life capital is in a hedge fund. I've been running the hedge fund since 2016. Yeah, those were low, the days were high. And I can tell you, my company today is not valued less than $1 million. My company is not valued less than that. I mean, in valuation, it's even more than. But let's pipe blue and do things. I don't want to talk about Daba. Daba is the new machine. Daba is one of my most impactful ideas. Guess what? 2013, I had an idea called my money machine world. The platform was to have a school where people can get access to mentorship, funding, and you know, classes like this. 2020, look at where the vision is. Don't give up. The vision is here for an appointed time. There are those of you who are here tonight. One of the things you should be doing tonight is to go and take a graphic design course to know how to design simple things like this. That's a skill you need. Go on Daba. Go on Designer Ed. Buy that course. Now, for the WhatsApp students, now let me write this down. When you implement an idea, it gives room for, the, for more ideas to flow. The reason why some of you don't know what to do is because the first idea that came to you, you did not implement it. Do you know, do you know I would have been the first to build an app in Nigeria where that shows people trading signal? I will not share something now, but the app we will launch for our trade signal has AI. I was planning to even travel to Singapore for it. 
See, the vision is here for an appointed time. At the time you say, now, if I want to go and run that project, now, the money is available. To go and go to Singapore, now me no get money to go to Singapore. But this time we're looking for investors to give us money, so I'll go to Singapore. I can show you the templates. I developed an app for trading signal. CC was the name of the lady that I'll be telling you. Have you ever seen an app where you say, give me Bitcoin price for today? And like Google Assistant, crypto, say, hello, Saludin, the price for Bitcoin is $10,000. Ethereum is $259. And the next thing is, any signal for today? Okay, a signal has been dropped. You can buy EOS at 2,000 sats, sell at this. Nobody has done that. I have the template in this phone. I have the template on this laptop. The vision is here for an appointed time. I paid how many million to develop that prototype? The vision did not work immediately in 2018. The first person who gave me one million to invest in my company, his name is Paul Gabriel. He's the only person who is a shareholder in digital abundance today, I me. Mean. Did, did I say I'm a failure because of that vision? No. But if I did not push that vision, maybe Daba will not come. The idea you make happen today gives room for the flowing of other ideas. It's like a river. When you block water from entering here, it will not come. But when you allow it, it will flow. That's why I have ideas flowing every day. So when an idea comes to me, I now dabble the idea. I digital abundance the idea. I christianize the idea. I customize it. I now like, let me share a secret with you guys. There's one ad you see on Daba that we're running today. I saw Bloomberg do that ad and the idea came to me said, customize this ad. Go and check it. If you have, if you have, if you, if you, if you see, if you have eyes, you'll see what I'm saying. But I'll not talk again here. Only my, only my leaders know this. I'm talking too much this night. That idea. The idea said, teach three people. Start that class. You know, start the class, but you're waiting to teach 30 people. You didn't start. Now, how do you want to now get to 1,000? Because you're waiting for the perfect time. And that's why you're not doing the work. And as you're not doing it, the money is not going to come. Boy, I'm on fire tonight. I need to stop this class. <laughs> I need to stop. Before some things start coming out of my mouth. You won't hear this anywhere like that. So get those vision notes. In that note, travel, travel in that note. See, you can even, next time I'm gonna teach you guys, start designing your vision in pictures. Then put numbers with it, add it. God is great. I want to help some of you develop your income stream. And this class is one of those classes I've been cooking since last month. It took me 24 hours to, to get this landing page ready. I discovered that when I shared this thing, it was like a challenge. But I discovered at the same time, I didn't know God was setting me up for a course. So I'm going to be teaching by July 17 and 18, how to make a thousand to five thousand dollars. If you are in the WhatsApp course, this is the next level course. This is the advanced course of my WhatsApp course. And I call it income boosting course. You want to boost your income, this is it. Income boosting course. And you know, I don't teach for information. I teach for impartation. I teach to push you to work. I won't teach you to give you information. I teach you to work. Watch what you're going to learn in this course. All wealth starts with income. I want to help your income. Funny, funny kind of stuff. Some of you, you know, in WhatsApp course, I saw some people were saying they don't know this. How do I, how to package your 
and price your product, number one. Number two, lessons from PlayStation 5. How come people started buying PlayStation 5 even before the thing came out? How come people were waiting to buy PlayStation 5 before it came out? Lessons from PlayStation 5. Number three, how to use Telegram. I discovered some internet marketers in Nigeria started using Telegram after they saw the success are recorded in Telegram. Today, we had over 50 people join our Telegram channel. How do you use Telegram to boost your sales? Number four. I discovered number four has six, but I'll be leaving it to four. Four skill sets that will produce money for you. Number five. How to engage people that will pay you or buy from you. Then business tools that will grow your revenue. Business tools that will grow your revenue. Number six, number seven, how to send messages that will trigger sales. Then number eight, Ah, bam, bararam, 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 bam, bam. How to do videos that will trigger fast sales. I did one video on crypto money bond. I sold almost a million in one week. Videos that will trigger sales. I stayed one time in Dubai. I did a selfie video. Videos. I'll teach you how to do videos. How to, how to hold your phone. You're going to do practical class. I will show you videos that Donald Trump was doing before even becoming a police. How videos has helped this guy? And how to build your first 100 to 1,000 buyers list, tools and strategies to use. If you get 100 buyers buying from you, you're good. If they go to 1,000, you are made. Number 10, product differentiation, how to use it to increase your revenue. This thing, people don't know. Some of you have, some of, that's why I say, some of you wonder why I'm not doing crypto, Forex, uh, stock, everywhere. Like, in one, how can you be in one sector and make more gains with one sector? This, this thing I'll teach you. And 11, practical lessons that has helped Donald Trump win as a businessman, as a politician. I'll show you the role of videos here. I'll show you the role of, I'll, I'll show you something. Then how I generate organic traffic for all my brands. Organic traffic is free. Free traffic. Free traffic. Okay? Free traffic. They are still developing this page. And so who is this Chris Adams? Some of you, in case you is the first time you're listening to me. I'm an author, I'm an entrepreneur, a startup advisor, a crypto trader and investor. I'm the CEO of Digital Abundance, a group of companies that uses internet and emerging technology to drive economic revolution and social change. Founded the first Bitcoin and crypto trading platform, education platform in Nigeria. Founded the fast growing Daba.school, an online education platform where individuals and organizations gain relevant strategies and in-demand global skills for scaling, wealth creation, and financial freedom. I'm also the author of Start Your Own Business, Crypto 101, The Life of a Nigerian Bitcoin Trader, and Crypto Money Bond, a compilation of videos and ebooks that help you to learn and profit from crypto even as a beginner. I'm impacting by building solutions, helping young people create wealth, alleviate poverty, and create jobs. Okay? So you want to take this course, it's just 25 US dollars. Now, there are those of you who paid for this class last month. I will allow you, only few of you paid for it. So I'll allow you. So uh, what you just need to do is come here, sign up for this course. Uh, you see, I think it's if boy, if you're a Daba student, go to your back office and sign up for this course. The videos will not be there, but the number once you pay, come to me. Just tell me you've paid. Okay, this is my personal class. Don't go to Ruth, just come to me. Just so three five two. Everybody, whether you're a WhatsApp student, a Daba student, everything is twenty five. Twenty five dollars is ten thousand naira. 
Okay. Once you pay, it's the same account. You can log, you can sign up for this course from your back office on DABA. But if you're not a DABA student, go to www.daba.school slash income boosting course. I don't know if the course is on DABA homepage now. Let me check. Let me check if it's on DABA homepage. Uh, Okay, it's not yet on Daba's own page. They not put, they not put the stuff there. Okay, so let's get that ready. Okay, let's 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 get it. Let's get it. Let's get the party started. Okay, let's get it started. Let's get it started. Let's get it started. And for those of you who are new, remember we have ladies' night coming. And uh, I want you to share. I want you to let everybody know about it. And, and 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 let's and let's kick this. Let's kick this. Let's kick this. Let's kick this. Okay, let's do ladies' night. Well, yeah, it's gonna be a night. It's gonna be a night. I'm super excited about this night. So if you've not registered now, if you have somebody who registered and they didn't send them email, just send the person the Telegram channel link. Okay, once you send another channel link, uh, the person will be there. We'll, we'll fix all these things. Is our autoresponder we're going to fix it and you guys are going to learn from different ladies now for the guys if you start coming say you want to come to this class i'll catch you and expose you because you don't know if babes will be twerking that day you are you will now come and because of this thing it's ladies night allow them let them do their ladies things and let ladies learn from each other okay so those of you who are paying tonight registration opens immediately now $25 is my starting price. People know me. $25 is my starting price. By the time the class hits seven days to go, I've increased the price of those costs. It can go to $35. I can decide to change it. That's how I started my WhatsApp course. It was started from, from $36. Okay? Start from $36. Enter $4,000. Enter $4,500. Enter $5,000. Next month, I'll change it to $6,000. want it to be $10,000. Now, so if you want to pay, Go right away. You can send me a chat. You can send Ruth Annie a chat. You have my number already, 70 This is what I'm going to cover in this course. I'm ready for these 12 packages. Share it, let somebody know. And this flyer, I think you can share this flyer now. Okay, you can actually share this flyer with everyone. We're going to put up the link there. Let them sign up, share this flyer with everyone. I'm going to share it on our Telegram channel. You go there, sign up, and uh, and then um, we get things running, okay? So all wealth starts with income. All wealth starts with income. How do you want to boost your income? Let's do this, July 17 and 18. This is my, this is my first paid class. This is the last WhatsApp class I held. My first paid class. I think this is my first paid class for the year, my first paid class that is live. Okay, apart from crypto money bundle, this is my first paid class. So Daba students, I know you guys have been waiting for this. And let's do this. How do you do it in 30 days? I'm gonna share with you more insights, more strategies that will help you. I'm sure you wanna boost your income. Tonight, uh, before we leave, we're already done. Jeez, too, we've spent too much here. Let me take questions. I want to 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 take questions. Somebody said about gents. Questions? If you've got questions, let me know. Let me know, let me know if you got questions. If you got questions. Okay, no questions. What WhatsApp group have you been talking about? Those who are in Daba know the, know the WhatsApp group, I mean. Those in Daba know it. If you're a Daba student, you know. If you're not a Daba student, go get the WhatsApp course, okay? Somebody say, can I enroll for the WhatsApp and digestion course? Why not? Some of you keep asking these questions all the time. Can I get it? It's knowledge. How to monetize your WhatsApp. You didn't say how to start your business. 
how to monetize that your WhatsApp you have. There are many things you can do with WhatsApp. That's why you're taking the course. So you go there, the course is 5,000. Okay, you want to take monthly marketing or go for work. Now, for those of you who are on Daba, there's no discount. No, those of you who are waiting for me to do discount, you probably don't know me yet. <laughs> I've changed discount level. I've hit 1,000 buyers. You don't know what it means. There's no discount. There's no discount. Now, for those of you who bought this course called Wealth Building Course, you are attending, you are attending this class for free. You are attending this class for free. All Wealth Building, all Wealth, wealth Building Masterclass. You're attending this class. This, this class for Wealth Building is 28,000. For those of you who, are, who bought this course, you are attending this one, this particular one for free. You are attending for free. Okay, you are attending this one for free. It's part of your course. But those of you who don't want to, who don't have any course on DABA, you're starting this one, or you have a course on DABA, you want to start with this, 10,000, that's 25 US dollars. That's what you use and you get, and you, and you are part of this class. So. You have to now give yourself time. You have to now, but once it gets to almost seven, once it gets to three days to go, the price of this course changes. All right. God bless you guys. Let me hear the feedback. Let me get the feedback. Let me. So tonight, please, Dapper Ladies Night, every stuff, okay? Uh, every stuff we've, 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 we've put, share, let everybody know about it. Please, if this, if, you, if this is your first time listening to me or hearing me speak, let me know, yeah. So much I have an idea, but I don't know what next step to take because it's something that has not really been done before. And I was kindly advise on what step to do. Start simple. What is this type of questions? When I see it, question I tell you, start simple. Start simple. Start something simple. Okay, start simple. Don't start with something so bogus. Start simple. Then make sure there are courses you're taking. I'm telling you, my WhatsApp course will teach you how to implement ideas. But you, you, you just, the name WhatsApp is called, is uh, making you blinded about it. Good luck, this I'm new here. I did enjoy the class. But the outline for the course is many said I was selling and improving one's product. But so how can one who doesn't really have anything to sell? Now look at it. Four skill sets that will produce money for you is part of it. Four skill sets. Four skill sets that will produce money for you. That's why you should be attending because you don't wait when you have a product to attend the meeting that will teach you how to make money with product or sell. You should be doing that when you don't even have anything yet. Okay? I think I've answered that. Good luck, Johnny. Okay? If this is your first time, let me know. Oh, Graham, this is my first time. God bless you. This is my first time. Uh, my first time. My first time. My first time. It's in beautiful. God bless you. If you're on our Telegram channel, make sure you get a course on Daba. Because once you have a course on Daba, I can now mentor you. And let me mentor my Daba student know what I mean. I send voice notes sometimes weekly, sometimes once in two weeks. Sometimes I can, I can, I can there's a way to get to my I can be sending daily for one week, for three days. And I charge you. I don't teach you and leave you. I teach you and make sure that you follow up. I sell men footwear. How can WhatsApp cost? Me? Where's eBay? Where's eBay? Where's eBay, Anthony? There's a guy called Emeka Julius. That one has sold hundreds of thousands of naira. People, people who buy, people who even buy cars. So down, down 700,000 naira of, of, of shoes. Of shoes. Okay? Anything, even if you're selling shit, we'll teach you how to do that via WhatsApp. Okay? So, go on, get the WhatsApp course. Get on board if it's WhatsApp course you need. But there's a pro, there's 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 a bond I'm launching. That's why I'm bringing out this course. I'm gonna match the WhatsApp course and this income boosting course together. It's called income boosting. Okay, let me help you boost your income. Let me help you 10x your income. You can follow the advice of Kelly Bright. Okay, you cannot go wrong learning from Chris and get a new skill. Get a new skill. You don't know how to edit videos. Go for video editing, okay? Go for these courses. Go for graphic design. So it's just 20,000. It's about uh, 28,000 or so. 28,000. This one is just 5,000. This one is 20,000. This one is 80,000. This one is uh, 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 100 or 40,000. Go there, sign up for any course, okay? Once you sign up for a course, 
you put in the your 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 if anybody referred you put in their email there and it's as easy okay chat to customer care on whatsapp you can chat you can see the chat box for whatsapp chat to the customer care and let the customer care tell you what to do if you're lost somewhere okay and they'll help you okay god bless you all god bless you all god bless you all god bless you all god bless you god bless you god bless you god bless you all right so we can call it a night today we can call it a night today thank you for attending and have your best season it's your best season do something you're not giving up the world is yours we are taking my prayer for you is that tonight uh the spirit of wisdom rests on you the spirit of knowledge rests on you the spirit of understanding rests on you your eyes will be open your understanding will be quickened and and may you be able to decide what to do this season okay and god himself will protect you and my prayer for you again is that god will send people who will lift your vision up who will lift your vision up Look at the likes of Steph, Ronald working for me. People think every day I see Steph. No. Look at those type of hands. Look at the likes of Tamilore. Look how God look how she goes in, God connected to me. Look at how different people. That's the way. Okay? See members that will uplift your vision. God will send them your way. And for things you've been pushing and pushing and pushing, and it's been delayed. This season. God's favor rests on what you do. Rest on what you do. It will, it, will, it will just come and the places you'll be seeking for answers, those things will come. And please, go on Twitter and vote for me. Go on Twitter and vote for me. Okay? Let's, let's see. Let's bring it home. Go on Twitter. Vote for me. Let's get this done. Let's get this done. Post it on your status. If you have friends, post it there. Tell your friends, put it up. Okay. Uh, okay, let me get the Twitter page. Let me get the Twitter page. Let me get it from Tammy Lori or from Digital Abundance. Um, okay. So go here, do the votes. And let's let's bring this home. Let's bring this home. So you can check the chat session. Okay, share in every group. Okay, so go there and, and vote. Vote on Binance. Vote on everywhere. Vote, 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 vote. Let's, let's get this done. And those of you who want to take the wealth course immediately, go to the link. In short, let me show you something. You want to take that wealth course now. You can go to that link and, and sign up for that course right now and, and even pay for it. Okay. Okay, so if you come here, put your name, put your email, register. Okay, I think once you register, it will take you to a place you pay or something. Okay, so WhatsApp Chris below to contact Chris. If that's what you want to pay or so, I think so. I mean, they're still working on that, Sha. Uh, where you pay or so. Okay. $25. Okay, I think there's a. So, like that, work on. They are still working on that. So, you can take it to message me and all that. All right, guys. Have a lovely night. Have a lovely night. Many thanks to Samuel for inviting me over. I'm grateful. He has paid for me for the world's booting course. Wow, Samuel, you're my destiny helper. Wow. That's great. That's great. That's great. That's great. Samuel, you're a great guy. 
You're a great guy. You're a great guy. You're a great guy. You're a great guy. Great guy. That's good. That's good to hear. That's good to hear. All right. Good night, guys. Thank you very much.